how to use hub stuff as an employee hi guys welcome back to the channel and for today's video i will show you how you can easily use hub stuff as an employee and by the way before we dive into our particular topic today just a quick overview hub stuff is one of the software that used by employer to monitor their employees especially working remotely this software can help employer to track employees time uh, track performance and productivity and also manage different tasks and projects. So to get started, you just need to go to havestuff.com and this is the main homepage. As you can see here, they have a free 14 days trial, but there's no need for you to worry if you want an employee because your employer is the one who will be paying everything for you to make use of the software. So when you're employer inform you that you will be using hub stuff then you will expect that you will be receiving an email inviting you to sign up in this platform hub stuff so you just need to click on the invitation email and then create your account to log in and once you created your account then you just need to choose that you already have a team for you to be added in that team so for now to get started with our tutorial today let me go ahead and sign in to my account so that i can show you the platform main dashboard so give me a moment so once you log into your account, this is your main dashboard and inside your main dashboard, you can see the overview of your work. So as you can see here, we have the mop and you can see your weekly activity, work this week, spent this week and project that you work within this week and many, many more. So you can also manage your widget here. Widget are these items here that you can see. You can manage this one. You can click manage widget and as you can see here, you will just check this widget here that you want to be added in your dashboard and then uncheck these other things that you don't want to be displayed in your dashboard. Just like the map, I uncheck it and as you can see, it removed from our main dashboard. And by the way, here it's the weekly activity or weekly performance of your team. If you want to see your weekly productivity or performance, then you just need to switch to me. So this is your own productivity or performance. So as you can see here, you can see your weekly activity, your work this week, earn this week, and the project that you work within this week. So this is your personal dashboard and the all is your performance or productivity of the whole team. So going forward here on your left side corner at the top, you can see here the timer. So you can start your timer here. So you can also close this one and you can see you also have your timer here. So you just need to click on this timer for you to start your timer to track your time but if you want to track your time more easier then you can download the hub stuff application in your computer so just click up here on the right side corner at the top you will see a person icon here so just click on that and then you have your download option here so just click download option for you to be redirected to this page where you can download the hub stuff so as you can see here you can download hub stuff for your windows device or also for another device like apple and you can also download it in your mobile phone so let me go ahead and download this one so i will just click download for windows since i am using windows device and it may take a few minutes to download as you can see here so just bear with me guys so once you downloaded the hub stuff application then just open it to install in your device let me click the install and then just click next and next and next okay and install now so let's just wait for it let's click next and then finished all right, so we need to log into our hub stuff app now. So let me go to log into my account, get started, click next, 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 and done. 
So here is the application, guys. So once you download the application, you can easily track your time just like this. You can just hit the play icon to start your time tracking. So let's go back to our Habstuff main dashboard. So over here in your dashboard, you can also uh, check your time sheets. So you can view and edit your time sheet here. And when you edit your time sheet that will be subject for approval, it will be showing up here under approval. And also under your activity, it's where you can see the screenshot. So time to time, once you started your time tracking, then this software will start taking screenshots of your um, computer screen. And also it will record all the apps that you open during your working schedule and also the URL that you visited during the working hour. So you need to be careful, guys, when you are using Habstuff, be careful of the apps that you open and the URL because your employer can also monitor that one. And also you can see the screenshots that been taken from your computer during your working hour. So you will be seeing it here under your screenshots. So I don't have anything today because I did not start my time tracking. And also for location, you have your map here and your job sites. And your project management is where you can manage your different projects and your to-do task. So let me check it here. Let's see the to-do task um, dashboard. Here inside your to-dos is where you can check all your uh, to-do list or your to-do task. So you need to check this one time to time for you to easily track the task that assigned to you by your employer or by your team leader. So you can also check your schedules here. This is where you can check your calendar and also request some time off, especially for special occasion. If you want to request a leave, then this is where you can go to time off request for you to send a time off or holidays uh, request for leave. And also reports is where you can check your time and activity, your weekly report, amounts owed, payments, and all reports. And people is where you can see the members and also the different teams inside your Hubstuff organization that you joined. And financial is where you can uh, check all the financials information like the payroll, the send payment, past payment, invoices, and the expenses. So just an advice, guys, when you are using Hubstuff, you need to be careful of the applications and the URL that you are visiting because this application will monitor or record that data and it will show up to your employer. And also, you need to work because the movement of the mouse, the keyboard, and everything will be also monitored by this uh, application and it will give a how much percentage you are working with your computer when you started the time tracking. So I guess that's all for today's video today about how to use Hubstuff as an employee. And if you have any question, guys, just comment down below and thank you so much for watching.